Well, for Mayor Adams, we know it's day three on the job, and he's sending a message that style is as important as substance, at least for now. Government Affairs reporter Melissa Russo has been out and about with Adams as he's showing off what he calls his swagger. She joins us in the newsroom with more. Hey, Melissa. Hey, Natalie. Eric Adams is not only trying to project strength in his first week on the job, he's talking about the fact that he's trying to project strength as the new mayor works to help voters form a strong first impression. When a mayor has swagger, the city has swagger. <laughs> when describing his governing style, Mayor Eric Adams today used the word swagger about a dozen times. This is a city of swagger. And without mentioning his predecessor by name, he said Bill de Blasio didn't have it. And the leadership should have that swagger. That's what, was, what has been missing in this city. All we did was wallow in COVID. But is all that swagger swaying New York? He's an ex-cop. That's what they do. So it's all talk right now. I love it because I love police. Well, he's not the Blasio, so that's all I'm happy about. With swagger has like a confidence to it. That's a good way to start. In recent days, Adams has shown he's big on bravado, quick to dismiss those who disagree with him, including the incoming city council. I'm going to ignore them. If they like it or not, I'm the mayor. Adams takes every opportunity to show who's in charge. This morning, he had this moment with the media. Don't do that. Order, not disorder. Clearly, some of what resonated with voters in these tough times was Adams's confidence, optimism, maybe even swagger. You know, if I were him, I wouldn't. Uh, say that word, I would show the swagger more. We need a mayor of swagger. We need a councilwoman with swagger. We need an assemblywoman with swagger. It is a very fine line between strength and arrogance, but so far I think he's, he's walking it the right way. At the end of the day, though, it's going to come down to results. It doesn't matter what he's saying, it matters what he does. We're going to do this, man. And usually the honeymoon period for mayors doesn't really last very long. Adams says that New Yorkers can expect clear messaging from him. For instance, today, emphasizing he has zero intention of shutting schools because of the latest COVID variant. David.